If you are interested in buying Star Wars The Old Republic or installing it for free, I will put both links down below for you to be able to install it. It is an amazing game, and as you can tell from my walkthroughs, it's pretty interesting. <laughs> so if you really want to have some fun and if you want to have a good time with the game, give it a check. It's not expensive, and it's really fun to play, and you can always invite all your friends. And it's also one of those games that you can live stream. So when you get the chance, install it. Later.
Grawl, the leaders aren't here. And you're gonna want to hear this. A neural disruptor? Can they even do that? It's possible, sir. Would incapacitate us all. However, I should be able to recalibrate the security shields to block out its effects. Do it. I don't want to be a twitching, drooling heap when the Condemned get here. That's one crisis averted. But you better get back here fast. Once they realize the disruptor didn't work, they'll attack in force. Just hold them off until I get there. We'll try, but no promises. Hurry back as soon as you can. We're all out. Too late. We held them off for a while, but they broke through. Most of our personnel fell back to the armory, but Kelsa, she was a model officer. Those animals cut her down without a second thought. Would have been a massacre if you hadn't warned us about that disruptor. Oh, they'll die for this. The Condemned, the Imperials, and Nirinos. I thought you wanted to resolve all this without violence. I've exhausted my mercy. Those maniacs want a bloodbath. I say we give it to them. They're barricaded in the control room. We prevented them from slicing the central terminal remotely. Now they're trying to access it manually. I saved one of the Magnetar rifles for you. Should get you through the security fields. Get in there and finish this.
How do you work this thing? This antiquated tech is older than... Nero knows? Company. I'd heard one of the famed Havoc Commandos was killing my men. Your reputation is well-deserved, Major. I'm glad our paths have finally crossed. Stand down, Niranos. Put a stop to this madness. Never! We've come too far to just crawl back into our cells. Neither I nor my comrades have committed any crime against the Republic. We will have our freedom, one way or another. Do shut up, Nero knows. No one wants to hear another speech. Just kill this upstart. We came to negotiate, Imperial. Fight your own battles. Speak for yourself. I'll take a fistful of Imperial credits over your crusade any day. Uh, at least a few of you animals know the meaning of loyalty. As for you, Nero knows, you can die with the rest. My own men, throwing me to the Imperials for a few credits. Only a lifetime in prison will breed that kind of desperation. But please, put down your weapon and let us speak. No one else needs to die today. I would have negotiated sooner, but those Imperial watchdogs wouldn't allow it. I thought they were your allies. Why the sudden change of heart? The Empire's aims were never ours. They extended a helping hand, only to catch us by the throat. But, if words are not enough, allow me to prove my sincerity. Attention, my fellow condemned! This is Niranos. Lay down your arms. It's time we resolve this peacefully. Stop right there, you murdering scum! You won't poison this prison anymore! Why are you just standing there? Kill that lunatic so we can end this madness! A good soldier knows when to fight and when to talk. You're not gonna listen to that madman, are you? How could you just forget everything he's done? Neither I nor any of the condemned have ever been convicted of a crime. We merely inherited our ancestors' sentences. All we want is our freedom. Perhaps a, a small piece of land on Belsavis, where we can live in peace. We deserve that much. Only thing this nutcase deserves is a blaster bolt between the eyes. If you don't kill him, I will! You've heard our demands. Do what you will. Just know that I'll die before I return to that cell. Niranos is willing to forget the past, Grawl. It's time you did the same. Do the right thing and help him settle his people. I... Yes, you're right. This has gone too far. You'll have your freedom, Niranos. You're going to work for it. I expect you and your people to help us restore order here. Agreed. And thank you for seeing reason. We will not forget this. I'm just glad we were able to settle this without any more violence. As am I. The sector is more or less secure now but a Colonel Hauer has been asking for assistance in the high security wing. I told him I didn't have any men to spare, but that you might be able to lend a hand. He's expecting you now. You go on ahead. We've got things under control here. Just be careful. The innermost wings are real madhouses.
Every soldier needs advanced training to beat the Empire. We hope our inventory will meet your needs. Thank you for your patronage. <laughs> Reminder, mechanized travel is for official business only. Be safe out there. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel beats. Reminder. Mechanized travel is for official business only. Be safe out there. Oh, a, a major havoc squad. This is huge. Oh, um, I'm Cal. Look, it's a it's a real honor to meet you. Real honor. Uh, you're here to help, right? Give me the situation, Cal. Now, with all the commotion going on, we started seeing breakouts from one of the labor camps. Some real bad characters in there, believe me. The worst is a guy named Gouch. You don't even want to know what that freak was up to before they locked him up. You told Harlan that several pilots were trapped in the prison now. Yeah, right, right. Because of Gouch. Let me explain. One of the guard officers, Brock, wanted to storm the labor camp and make sure Gouch didn't escape. Bit obsessed, that guy. Well, three of our people volunteered to back Brock up. But things went bad at the labor camp, and now they're all trapped. Can your pilots confirm their current situation? I, I can't get through to them. Last I heard, they were holed up pretty good. Here are the last coordinates Brock gave me. You should find everyone there. A little stressed, so go easy on them. Oh, one other thing. Somebody shut off all the surveillance cameras in the area, so if you could switch them back on, it'd help a lot. Grab the pilots, fix the cameras. I'm on it. Good luck, Major.
Colonel Howard? Warden Grawl told me you could use a hand here. That's right. Heard you put down a riot in his neck of the woods. Heck of a feat. Certainly piqued my interest. Senator Tudos, Chairman of the Penal Oversight Committee, delighted to finally meet you. You know, I applied for military service myself when I was your age. <laughs> Didn't pan out, but I do love a good war story. Senator, focus. Right. Things have spiraled out of control here. Thousands of prisoners on the loose. Segregation thrown out the door. A veritable frenzy of interspecies violence. Then I'd hop on the first ship out of here. This is no place for a senator. Tempting, but the Republic has invested no small sum into this facility. I need to make sure certain uh, interests are being protected. Our biggest concern is a tribe of Ratataki called the Blood of Talith. Bunch of raving fanatics bent on slaughtering every other species. They are ambitious, crafty. Recently took to ambushing warden droids and stripping away their power cores. Intel suggests they're compiling the stolen power cores into one massive bomb. Probably mean to blast their way out of here. The infrastructure here looks pretty solid. You don't think it'll hold? And the walls are reinforced with duracrete. But even they won't withstand a few dozen power core explosions. If the rat attacky break free, they'll kill anyone they find. Guards, prisoners... Not to mention senators. You've got to disable that bomb and contain this madness. Those red attacky aren't going anywhere. Splendid. I knew we could count on you. It'd probably be best to keep the red attacky from acquiring any more power cores. If you can retrieve some of the power cores they stole, we should be able to modify the warden droids to prevent future tampering. Dismantling that bomb comes first, though. There should be a security terminal somewhere in the area. Report in when you've defused the bomb. On your feet.
Senator, I've disarmed the bomb. The rat attacky aren't going anywhere. Excellent. A crisis contained is a crisis controlled. I'll inform Colonel Howard at once. Gina Hagua, Buntagu, Shubalonkaku, Shubala Wawuni Kupa, Tomti Dak Maki Chisa. What's that? Is someone else there? Kuana Chuta, Kasayali, Koire Do, Kanki Kong. Is there something you haven't told me? I will Baska Punyo, Baska! That's enough. I am a member of the Republic Senate. I don't answer to the likes of you. Colonel Howard and I were overseeing a military exercise of sorts. Project Noble Focus. We tested prisoners of varying species against one another and analyzed the results. All entirely consensual. Kavaji Oto, Takogo Hota. No pisto bambaula. I don't like going into battle without all the facts, Senator. Surely you're no stranger to classified information, Major. Runda kavakio topa bubanda baka, murishaneta. Kiko bo kili, watabunki dongo, patagawata. The Rattataki are a dangerous bunch. You're lucky to be alive. Gaptula do bota dwana winki slimo, poya tuka changa. Kipuna male tota ad mishka kabano tasema. Chileska chananga wa ning chi kospa inigo dade. Don't waste your time with filth like him. He made his bed, now I can lie in it. You'll be safe in the minimum security wing. I can tell you how to get there. Wa fapa, jiu wanta hompa muli, ra bampa ula. If you're done fraternizing with prisoners, we can use you back at the base. There are new developments. Colonel Howard can fill you in when you get here. We'll talk more then. Senator Tudos told me you defused the bomb. Not a moment too soon. And I see you brought back the stolen power cores. I'll have our engineers start modifying the warden droids immediately. The Roger. We need to talk about Project Noble Focus. There'll be time enough for that once the Ratataki have been dealt with. Focus on the crisis at hand for now. Our satellites have picked up a large number of Ratataki in the Nemoidian compound. Up to their usual antics. Here I was, hoping it was just a social call. The satellite images we've seen are pretty grisly. Far as we can tell, they're butchering the Nemoidians. We've got to get down there and put a stop to it. 
I'm not so concerned about saving the Moidians as I am putting down the Ratateki. We've confirmed that Sulkaz, the blood of Talath's ringleader, is personally overseeing this latest massacre. He's everything you could want in a fanatical leader. Loud, ruthless, and utterly demented. Eliminating Sulkaz will take the fight out of the Ratataki. Show them who's in charge. You've got to get down there and stop him. This Sulkaz is about to find out how we do things in Havoc Squad. Expect a bloody fight. Sulkaz rarely does anything without someone dying. Make sure it's not you.
Take it easy, Simo. They're Republic soldiers. They must be here to help. Havoc Squad, we're here to pull you out. Havoc Squad? One of you have an uncle in the Senate or something? Not me. Does this mean we can finally get out of this place? We're not going anywhere. I swore an oath to keep the prisoners on Belsavis locked up. I'm not gonna leave and let this scum escape. I go free whether you stay or go. Run now, and maybe I won't find you once I'm out. I'm under orders to bring all Daggerwing personnel in. There's no time for this. In Daggerwing, we do what we say. And we said we'd help Brock hold this ground. You can always lock Galge up in another cell, Brock. It'll be a hard run, but if you get us back to the entrance, we can take Galge the rest of the way. We'll follow your lead, Major. Let's get out of here.
We're here. We made it. Thanks, Major. We'll drop Gouge off at a holding cell and get back to base. See you around. Fuckin' on your bitch, yeah, that's that, that. Looking up, open the park, pot, pot.